Hello ladies and gentlemen, today I would like to talk about file wrap PUP, a detection of a WAST or AVG antivirus that you may see while attempting to run a certain program. It usually points at an unwanted application, but may also be a false positive. In this video I will explain how dangerous that is and how to stop the detection from appearing. So, to begin with, let's find out what the detection means. File rep PUP is in fact an abbreviation from a rather long word combination. File reputation potentially unwanted program. But in fairness, it explains this data pretty well. The anti malware program in this case was triggered on an unwanted program, particularly one that was added due to its bad reputation. Unwanted programs may sometimes appear among apps that you think are completely okay. That does not mean they are malicious or dangerous, it is just about their bad reputation. The reason for such a detection from the antivirus vendor may be different. From the way the program spreads, to the monetization ways and certain behavior elements that may be harmful to the user. The way that you may have got an wanted app in your system is usually through software bundling. While installing a free program or a cracked version of a software or a game, you may not as a window with an offer to install quote unquote recommended software. And that is it. Unwanted software simply piggybacks on some legitimate applications. And considering how well the developers or ones who made the cracked app version disguise this these menus, it is not hard to make a step in the wrong direction. But all this aside, there is one more reason for the file wrap PUP detection to appear. It is just a false positive detection. It is especially possible if you are using a free version of a WAST or AVG antivirus. In such a mode, they lack frequent updates, and because of this, they may start detecting malicious elements in completely safe programs. This particular case is confirmed by the numerous reports from the users who cannot access completely normal programs, because the antivirus simply blocks them with this detection. If you see this detection on a program that you are sure is safe, consider adding it to the whitelist. Though it may be hard to be completely sure about every program you have, especially if you do not have that deep of a knowledge in cybersecurity. To clear the situation up and see whether there is anything you should be worried about, I recommend using Gruden Soft and Tamilbar. This program will easily find and remove any unwanted programs if they are present, or if there are none, justify the false positive from other antiviruses. Download it by the link in the description and run a standard scan to check the places where unwanted programs typically reside. It will take around 5 minutes. After the scan, click Clean Now to remove the detected unwanted applications. If you don't see any, well, as I said, it was likely just a false positive detection. In any case, good luck and stay safe online.